The foundation of Scrum lies in empirical process control theory, or empiricism. Empiricism asserts that knowledge comes from experience and making decisions based on what is known. Scrum employs an iterative, incremental approach to optimize predictability and control risk. Three pillars uphold every implementation of empirical process control – transparency, inspection, and adaptation. In transparency, significant aspects of the process should be visible to the people responsible for the outcome. Transparency requires those aspects be defined by a common standard so observers share a common understanding of what is being seen. The participants must share a common language when referring to the parts of the process, and those performing the work and inspecting the resulting increment should also share a common definition of done. Inspection. Scrum users must frequently inspect Scrum artifacts in progress towards a sprint goal to detect undesirable variances. Their inspection shouldn't be so frequent that it gets in the way of work, but inspections are most beneficial when they're diligently performed by skilled inspectors at the point of work. Adaptation. If an inspector determines that some aspects of a process deviate outside the acceptable limits and that the resulting product will be unacceptable, the process or the material being processed must be adjusted. An adjustment should be made as soon as possible to minimize more deviation. The Scrum framework includes four formal events for inspection and adaptation, as described in the Scrum events section of the Scrum Guide. Sprint planning, daily Scrum, sprint review, and sprint retrospective. You'll hear about the values of Scrum in the next video.